Alright, we're checking out the only game where the weirder the jumps get, the more magnified my pain becomes. It's GTA. We wanted to put different GTA cars against the weirdest things to jump over, and so Alex has created a brand new challenge. Using things that must have come from the toy box of the devil himself, he has prepared all of these different stunts that I have to jump over. There's explosive jumps, there's delicious jumps, there's jumps that would make Vin Diesel proud. Obviously, the jumps aren't just going to let this happen, so he's crafted ways to get them to try and strangle me, apparently. As always, Alex has given us all these different cars with which to do this, but only one can make it all the way to the end. Let's do this. I think I love the fact that even the meme cars here look legit. Welcome to the cereal bowl jump. Why do I get the feeling like I'm going to be saying things that I never thought I would say before? Are those murderous Fruit Loops? They look like shotgun propelled Fruit Loops. The fact that Alex can put together a cereal bowl that is the, oh God, did I just get stuck? <laughs> that he could put a cereal bowl together the size of a volcano is incredible. I'm amazing at GTA. So what happens when you're in here? Does it hurt to get bludgeoned? Ow. Okay, well, I guess it does. I was gonna ask if it hurts to get blue bludgeoned by a Fruit Loop, but uh, yep, it sure does. Oh, there's infinite Fruit Loops. They respawn. We've cured world hunger. All right. Well, if we gotta jump it, we gotta jump it. World hunger. Go! Whoa! <laughs> I feel like I wasn't going to come at Ah, that felt great. I feel like I wasn't gonna come close at all to completing that until that Fruit Loop like shot me into the air. Nothing quite like starting the entirety of the episode with a black eye 30 seconds in. So there's no way for me to get from point A to point B in this. Uh, well, so we can kind of wall ride this. Now, oh God, the, the area to land on is really small though. That was close. Hey, come back with me to Florida. Shh, shh, go to sleep, go to sleep. I'm gonna try and curb boost this. Maybe we can get a little, well, yeah, you can get a little bit of extra speed, but it still can't make it across. I'm gonna try this one or two more times just to see. Okay, I was way off to the right. Come on, baby. That looks terrible. Welcome to the place where good ideas go. Wait for it to die. Uh, all right, maybe I should just get a different car. Uh, you know what? Sure. The aerodynamics on the side by side. <laughs> oh hold on, hold on, I can live. Six to land, yeah! <laughs> oh! <laughs> well, <laughs> I almost died about 60 times just then. <laughs> what I was gonna say is the side by side gets way better air than the quad. 25 immovable grays jump. <laughs> okay. So what did you, did you like rip me out of real life and you turned me into a GTA asset? Oh my God, you did. I am so concerned. This is literally like looking into a mirror. Well, I don't feel any sympathetic pain. All right. You know what they say? If you can jump a cereal bowl, you can jump yourself. Ooh. Wow, I have a really hard head. I mean, that's true. If you asked me what my special ability in GTA is, it's the ability to land in every tree and miss every pool. Are you ready? Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I, I failed about as close to non-failing as I could fail. Oh, one time! There we go. Ooh. Oh, uh, I think I can still land this. Ow! Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Totally in control right now. Planned it since the beginning. All right, how do I want to even try to do this? I don't know if I can get the... No, they're, they're definitely immovable. The problem is the ramp isn't very tall. All right, we're going to try to apply as much downforce as possible. If this doesn't work, I'm going to need a faster car. And... Pull it back. I mean, I cleared it, but then you have to land on the landing pad. I know I said pull it back. What you really want to do is lean it forward to try and get that extra momentum. Also, how's your knees feeling? Oh, yeah. It's atomic. That's got to count for something. Fortunately, depending on how well it clears the cereal, 
I know right away whether or not this is even slightly possible. Wow. It doesn't feel very fast, but man, the distance this thing's get uh, this thing gets on the jump. Ow! <laughs> what happened? Okay, let's try it. Oh! Oh, okay, yep. Just one, two, three, four. Four backflips! I think. It may have been more. I don't know. Counting isn't really my strong suit, especially when I'm, you know, about to vomit from the Ah from the, the tilt of whirling my car is doing. Okay, this thing could definitely get far enough. It's more a matter of oh God. Can I land? Oh yeah. Okay. Oh, yep. Didn't like any either of those doors anyway. Let me have that. <laughs> the Cheerios are heat-seeking Cheerios. They're ballistic Cheerios. The next thing that the government's gonna use in combat. I feel like this car could do it, but I can't get a clean jump. There we go. Clean jump. Perfect. Nice, easy landing. Keep the speed. We're running it fast. And big j There we go. Right there. Big money sticks the landing. What is this? Those are taco trucks? Is that a taco ramp? <laughs> yeah, taco jump. Okay. Oh, man. I love me some tacos. I'm going to hate them after this episode more than likely, but... For the moment, I do enjoy them. It looks like you just have to get over the gigantic stack of taco trucks, and of course, they are not dynamic. This is an interesting taco combination because I have to use tacos in order to get over the tacos, and I'm assuming that right there is a slowdown. Yep, a slowdown stick. So we're gonna have to do this from there. Big jump, nice height, not even close. Uh, well, I lost the hood. Maybe losing that part of the hood, ow, maybe losing that part of the hood will reduce our weight and allow us to get higher. I'm gonna say that, and then I'm also gonna try and curb boost this. Yay. Oh, ooh, all right. I mean, I only had one taco truck left to get past. Get rid of that door, too. Oh, ooh, oh. I can just barely get underneath the topmost taco truck, but then I can't get any further. All right. This one's purple. It's gotta be good. You boys like baseball? Tear. Or tear. One of the other ones. I don't know. Anyway, is it fast? Does it jump far? Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. When this thing gets good, yeah. When this thing gets going in the air, it's incredible. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that cinematic jumping, baby! Oh! I jumped over the stop stick! Yes! Yes! No! <laughs> Come on! Oh, that was the chance! I came all the way back to the beginning because I want this. I want the perfect run. There. You cannot best me, Taco! Whoa! Oh my god! That is a very small area to land on. Oh, you gotta punch it. You gotta push it to the limit! Now I gotta line this up so I don't go too far off to the right or the left. Oh, this could be it. This could be it. No. No! I overshot it! Like, my three feet. Okay, good landing. Keep it perfectly straight. Jump myself. No big deal. Almost lost my side view mirror. Trying to pull this thing back on the middle of the road. That worked out really good. Okay, that looks good. That looks good. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. There you go. Tacos have been bested by the blade of my hunger. Don't play with gasoline, kids jump. I shouldn't need to tell people that, but I guess it's... I guess it's good that we're being considerate of individuals who might want to play with gasoline. Okay, so this is a giant explosive jump. So I'm gonna have to jump over the tankers. I don't have any weapons. So Alex hasn't given me anything. So I'm gonna wanna jump over the tanker, the propane, all of the explosive barrels. All right, the question is, can this jump far enough to get past every single explosive? I can't believe I just messed that up. How did I not hit anything? Over the cereal. 
over the replicated grays, over the taco. What happened? My car like bottomed out on the taco shells. It's okay, we're gonna give this one more try. And if not, oh, if not, I'll probably have to look, no! Oh, God. I'll probably have to look at a different car because without that extra momentum, Yep, it can't make it. All right. I know this one can get incredible height. Cereal? Yeah, feels good. Gray still plays. Doing great. Oh, wow. It, it lands really straight, too. So now, can it get over the taco truck with that? <laughs> it kissed the very top taco truck. Also, you have to land on this, if you notice, because it's raised. Okay. Don't play with gasoline, kids. Let's see if we can do it. We'll know right away. Jump. No. Oh my god! Oh, I thought it made it across. I thought I I thought I banked off of a explosive barrel and made it. I want to try this one more time. Ooh. I want to try this one more time just to see if there's oh, anything I can do. I got to get past this slow down stick. No, it's not going to get it if I get slowed down. There we go. There we go. Okay. Got past it. Taco shells over the taco. Look at how straight this thing jumps now. Oh, the sign stopped me. The sign. Okay, this has got to be it. Okay, go perfectly straight over the... S All right, you know what? Let's try a different car. I'm not messing around anymore. We're going with F1. Are you ready? Cereal. Look at it. Look at the distance. Incredible. Right there. Gray still plays. Oh, one time. Glorious. I almost touched my back wheel there. In fact, it may have touched the back wheel. Uh, hmm. The only problem is, again, I need to get past the stop stick area. Well, I say that. Maybe it can do it. Hold on. Maybe this is the car that can jump this with no help. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, wow. I have lost every part of this car. There is almost nothing left of this thing, but it did it. It really did it. Okay. Don't play with the gasoline, kids. Here we go. Oh, I feel good about this. Ayetis! Yeah! <laughs> we cleared that last barrel by about one centimeter. All right, there's not much left of the car, but it's still making it happen. Florida Happy Meals Be Like Jump. Ah, yes, the Octecacillion cheeseburger. <laughs> it's got enough saturated fat to kill 35 countries simultaneously. Oh, and don't forget the toy, of course, and your 685,000 ounce high fructose corn syrup soda. I feel like I'm getting heart disease just standing next to this thing. All right, let's see if we can do it. Go! Whoa, oh, uh, oh, wow, I only got up to like the 35th burger. <laughs> I love that this is a half mile tall burger. Well, that's a problem. Fortunately though, getting back to that point with this car is super easy because it can do everything. Oh, I say that and now I'm gonna die. Oh, <laughs> the perfect bounce. He's the best in the world. Oh, oh. Just tapped it. The best in the world lands it. Not really the best in anything. I guess the, uh, I guess it should more or less go. He has the highest pain tolerance in the world. Oh God. Oh. Oh my God. Well, this is, uh, oh no. This is unbelievably bad. Um, oh God. Oh no. It's fine. I can, I, we're, we're okay. I can save this. I'm kidding. I can't save this. Don't ask me how I didn't blow up last time. I have no idea. Huh? Ah! <laughs> I got past it. I outran the explosions. Now that is Michael Bay. All right. Now I got to know though, do we have any chance? There's no way. There's no way this can get over the burgers. This feels like a terrible idea, but it does have a burger in the back. And we've been getting stopped by the burger. 
Okay. My plan is, hopefully, the burger sees us as one of its own. Kind of like uh, putting, oh wow. Kind of like putting zombie skin all over you and then walking amongst the zombies. Maybe that'll work for the burger. Or maybe I can't even get past myself. Or maybe I can, or I can't. That was a roller coaster of emotions. So, <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Hey, I get the feeling I am not gonna be, oh, or, okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Nope, the problem is this thing's so long, it just falls, it just falls off. All right, you are the chosen one for the win. Cereal, incredible. I should have known that a supercar would do good, but I kind of felt like I'd end up having to jump through something and I would need some bulk too. Wow, oh my God. Woo, okay, I have a feeling we're going to get past the tacos on the very first try. I was completely correct. I just have to make sure I can, no, okay. I just need to land it a little bit straighter. Jump, what happened there? I managed to hit everything. I feel like because this thing is so low to the ground, it keeps getting stuck on stuff. But it is very fast and it jumps very high. Now, hold on. Uh, it overshoots a lot though. If there is any car that I can complete this challenge with though, it's gotta be this one. It's all about there. If I can land that nice and straight and then line this up perfect, that's got to be good, right? That's got to be good, right? It's going to be close. Oh! oh, stop, 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 stop. Yeah! I'll trade some paint for some pain any day. Now, don't play with gasoline, kids. First try, 100%. Boop. Oh, God, maybe not. Ah! It's okay, I have an idea for the gasoline. We're gonna go ahead and curb boost this. That should get us there. Um, man, it is close. Barely. <laughs> that was probably the closest I almost came to not getting over the taco trucks. I could feel the taco sign tickling my catalytic converter. Jump! Lean forward, there we go. That was a good clear. So it's, oh, oh God, hold on. I don't wanna, I don't wanna mess this up. I want a nice clean go of this one. Okay, we wanna get to the top of the hill and then punch it. Maximum downward power. Off the ramp, lean forward. Oh, 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 oh! Over the sesame seed, sticks the landing. Is that a blade? <laughs> Is that a, was that a, was that a plane with a burning hoop on it? Oh, the fast and the furious jump. Of, of course, of course it is. And yeah, it's a plane with a burning hoop on it. <laughs> okay. I love that in the beginning, fast and the furious was about a guy who owns a sandwich shop. And in the end, he's like jumping Dodge Hellcats in space. Wow, I need to, I need to way delay my jump more. It's okay though. Getting over tacos and hamburgers is trivial. He who crests the burgers becomes king of the burgers. The burger king, actually, if you will. Uh, let me see if I can land this without messing this up. So that's pretty straight. Okay, we're gonna want a nice, easy forward movement. And then we're gonna line this. That's, that's perfect, that's good. And nice solid landing. Okay. So fast and the furious jump. I think where I'm gonna wanna start it is when the front wheel, yeah, right there. When the front wheel is getting to the front, to, to the point where it can take, oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, I got it. <laughs> it's a teleporter, I did it. Oh my God. What? No. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That's okay. This can be done. Over the burger. Uh, tilt it. Okay. That was that was about as about a close of an arc. It's like I'm uh, encircling the the solar system of the burger. 
So wait for it. Not yet. Not yet. We want that front tire to get close to the point where it's leaving the pad right now. And... Oh, this looks good. This looks good. Here we go. 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 This looks good. Okay. And now get out of the way. Okay, I made it. Get out of the way so we don't get hosed <laughs> by the landing gear. Oh, and that means that we have a winner. Well, I jumped over the weird things, but the weird things took part of my soul. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of GTA. Until next time, stay foxy and much love. <laughs>